welcome to a new vlog. I'm here with Margarita. Super excited. I'm gonna do this real quick because the estate sale closes in one hour. As you can, as you saw, guys, in the last clip, we are at an estate sale today. It's my first time going to an estate sale. Uh, I'm not really interested in buying anything, but I do want to walk around, look around, show you guys, take you guys with me. For you guys that don't know how an estate sale works, I want to show you. Um, I really want to start introducing a lot of interior design into my YouTube channel because if you guys don't know, I don't really talk about it, but I'm really into interior design. I love it. And I think this is a good way to introduce you guys. So let's go. Okay, so we are in Van Nuys. Is that how you say Van Nuys? Van Nuys, yes. <laughs> Van Nuys. <laughs> tags and what you do is you put your if you sell it if you want to buy it you put your name on it and then um, you can get it at the end so that you're not carrying everything such your vibe dude it's the couch that i want no no you guys this is a nancy myers movie i love a, a sofa with a slip cover look at the mirror look at the ceilings the music I love the china, these plates, even the pillows. I might get some throw pillows. That's really what I'm into. I'm looking. This is my fucking <laughs> I'm feeling for you. <laughs> This is a perfect um, cabinet for a dining room because you can put all your silverware on the top and then your plates at the bottom and then display some stuff up there. You can. This is kind of like a buffet kind of tabletop. Uh, the cute little mirror, which having mirrors in your dining room really expands the room if it's a small room. Well, let's go into the kitchen because I love it. What do you think about this family that you're here? <laughs> That one's cute. I like it for a kitchen. For sure. yeah. It's more farmhouse vibes. I'm not farmhouse vibes. For the kitchen, I do like it. I love the window. I love how big it is, right? Yeah. So tall. A lot of cabinets on top with the glass for like display. Beautiful for plates, cups, mugs. Such a long time. Yeah, well. Tell me the story about this house though. Like, they, they have to sell everything because they're moving or they're getting kicked out? I don't know if the owners are dead. So it's maybe, deeper than what I thought. <laughs> maybe. Should be. We got a little laundry room, and I can't wait to take you guys to the garden. Period. How cute for you to So, this is a very like indoor outdoor area. What would you do with this? Like, you purchased this house, what would Tomas do with this space? This yeah, this exact room. It's small, has like these beautiful doors that take you right outside. I need to see the rest of the layout of the house, but because the dining room is over there. The living room is in here. Oh. Bathroom. And then there's a study in there. So this could be a second. This could be like the informal dining room. So that's the formal dining room. This and this is like, like everyday dining room. Or you could have the. Um, formal living room over there and this could be more like a TV room uh, lounge yeah. area damn it's huge so what I believe from the video that I saw is that the owner of the house was uh, an interior designer and that's why there's so much it's so beautiful wow and this is the door to a laundry room yeah so cute. I love the architecture of the house, even on the outside and the inside. The way that the rooms connected has a, like a very flowy um, 
layout and it's not a open concept which i love open concept houses have become such a big thing uh in the past like 20 years 10, 15 years but um i do love a house that has like its separations in the room as long as it flows nicely to have that separation just makes it so much more cozier in my opinion but look at the house first of all it's a beautiful day in california Margarita found a swing. Yeah. You guys, this is a beautiful no, is house with the little arch. It's very cottage style, very American, very. I don't know, I love it. <laughs> I was walking around, I was on FaceTime with my mom showing her because if you guys don't know, I'm obsessed with Nancy Myers and her interior design in her movies. So also, if you don't know, I went to film school, right? So I'm also, I also work in the film industry. So kind of like those two um, passions that I have, I wouldn't say hobbies, I would say passions that I have kind of like merge like that with those movies. And this house, I'm gonna walk you guys around it for a little more. It literally feels like we're in a Nancy Myers movie. I love it. I showed you guys the swing. Let me try, let me test it out for research purposes. <laughs> I like it. We gotta, uh, so my parents have a ranch and I'm telling them to, that they gotta put a swing like this. You know, like a long ass swing in the house. Well, in the farm, so it would be super, super cute. But let's go inside. Let me show you guys more. <laughs> Out here, we obviously have like all the outdoors. So. I love all these terracotta planters if you guys are into like gardening. Look, one dollar each on less markets. We might take some home. Do I garden? No. <laughs> are you I thinking love? about doing it? Do maybe. I, do I like a good terracotta planter? Yes. You know what's funny? The terracotta is supposed to be terracotta. <laughs> terracotta. <laughs> Laundry. Laundry super cute. Did you show it? Of course. Are you? So we have this one. This one. The cigarette room, yes. <laughs> Too. It's very cottage. Again, it's, this is a very American cottage style home. I love it. Here. We have this little hallway that, hallway that connects the living room. There's a bathroom. I think there's something here right now. Yeah. I'm not using the bathroom, but. <laughs> it's beautiful house. It really it is. is. You should take a picture of the ceiling. And the we did. Yeah, we we did. did. First thing. <laughs> So now that I see that there's a fireplace here, oh, I would cool. make this the casual living room and I would make that a study. But I do like that this has the built-in bookshelves. Show the built-in bookshelves. And again, the entire house has the, show the, the, food, the feet of the couch. So it's like all with the sleep cover, uh, the sleep cover sofas. Yeah, that's how we have them in my house. And then we have a corner window, nothing better than a corner if you put like a bench that goes like across and beyond like an l-shaped bench with like a little stool table such a cute reading nook i need to get the reading all the way back look point out how how much detail classic homes like this used to have they don't make they don't build homes like this anymore so this is the entrance, and then we go over here to the Where's master. Where's the master? Oh, this there is you go. The, the hallway to the master. Built-in cabinetry. And then this is a master ba ba bathroom. Oh wait, look, there's Closet. a secondary bedroom. Cute. Like a kid room. With creepy-ass dolls. Love it. <laughs> this could be a guest bedroom. Kid's bedroom. 
again, show them how everything in the house has built-in cabinetry. I love it. Very classic built-in cabinetry. It gives more space. I'll take it to the master bedroom because there's people in the bathroom right now. Again, not fucking using it. <laughs> 68 bucks, that's a good price. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Right off the master bedroom, we have the like little porch area with the double doors that open up, and you have like a what do you call this? A pergola? Uh, kind of like a, a gazebo type thing. Dude, mm. all women's clothes. Was she single? <laughs> <laughs> Rich and single. Okay. What's better? Here we have the closet with all built-in cabinetry, and then the master bathroom. Beautiful. Look at this bathtub. It's beautiful, you guys. Look at the bathtub. Ooh, look at the, the shower. The window to the backyard, and you have the walk-in shower like this with the glass doors. See this. So this is actually also built-in um, with a little sink. Again, the chrome detail. This all the all the hardware in the house is chrome, which is super interesting because chrome is now trending so much in interior design, so it's really coming back. But here you have more like brass, unlacquered brass on these handles. So something that I do love to do in a house is to mix metals. So you don't want everything to match. People are scared of mixing the metals. You should. You have to. I mean, Titanic vibes, am I right? No? Like rose from the Titanic. Show them the wall sconces. Look how interesting the wall sconces are. Right in here. Mm -hmm. And before we leave the bathroom, you can see all the um, detailing on the walls, which is also really, really coming back. I don't know if we showed you guys already the door, but I love it. I love doors that uh, have the division in the middle. Are you seeing it? Are they yeah. seeing it? So they have the division in the mirror, so you put it in the middle, so you can only open the top if you want to check it. It's very classic. Very, you don't see those anymore, huh? Margarita waiting for me in line. I'm smart. Did you grab something? No, um, I'm just in line for you, but now I have to speak. <laughs> <laughs> so this is the like little garage area where you pay, where you check out. You guys, we just left the estate sale and I'm so happy this was the first time ever that I went to an estate sale. I found it thanks to TikTok. To, you know, tomorrow's the last day of the estate sale, by the way. Um, but I'm posting this tomorrow. So anyways, it's too late for you guys, but... Um, it was such a beautiful, beautiful house. It was such my aesthetic, the build of the house, not the decor, the interior design of the house, but the actual architecture of the home was so beautiful. I got a couple things. I got, I just got three things. I got a cute little basket for five bucks. Um, I want to style this in one of my bookshelves. And I got two interior design books. Um... You can see they so they take your stuff if you're holding on to stuff they take it they take it to the garage or wherever they are um, checking people out and they put your little name they put Thomas with an H my name's Thomas but you know it's fine so I got two books this is romantic country style this is an interior design book and I got another one which is bedrooms by Victoria so there were a couple of these there was bedrooms and then floor of roasts in a house or something like that but that one's florals and I'm not interested in florals you guys or landscaping I that it's not my thing I'm not really uh, knowledge in that but I'm super excited with what I got the books were eight bucks I loved the estate sale again my first experience ever going to an estate sale and I love taking guys with me let me know if this is something that you are interested in seeing more again interior design is something that I'm super passionate about so I feel like I really do want to start introducing that into the channel um, so if this is a video that you guys liked then for sure let me know down in the comments and um, I'll make more of these. Super happy with what I got. I'm so happy that I got to go to the estate sale. If you guys have any questions about how estate sales work or you want to go to one, you want to know the research, like um, how to go to one, where to find them, 
you can let me know reach out to me and i'll for sure let you guys know more about that but thank you guys so much for watching i hope you guys enjoyed it it's a little bit different from what i usually do but yeah i'll see you guys on the next video